Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Or welcome if this is your first time watching me. Okay, so day number 84, I think. Yep. Listen early off to the gym here. Your first training. Okay, 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 okay. Let's just, let's just back out of the garage here. Get my keys. Gotta have them. I'm um, just back out of this garage here. And I got a, I got a good song today for you guys, okay? Hopefully no one disagrees with it or it causes a kerfuffle or anything, but uh, it's a song that I do enjoy myself. Hopefully you can enjoy it too. Well, let's, let's cue it. Yep, 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 yep. My God's not dead, he's surely alive. He's living on the inside, moving like a lion. Alright, that was the Newsboys. Good song, good song. Even if you uh, leave or not, uh, you know, I, I feel like it's still like a good song either way. Oh yeah, we all, all three of us could have went. We're still waiting, we're still waiting, we're still waiting, we're still waiting. We literally all could have went. Oh my, lordy lord. Whatever, that's okay. It's all part of God's God's plan. You know, I saw this quote one day. I saw it years ago, and I always I always think about it when I drive now. That's why I've never been an angry driver ever. I always think like everything is like part of God's plan. Like me sitting behind these people makes it so like maybe I like coincidentally, you know, don't cr don't get in a car accident or anything. And holy shit. Look at that view. Look at that. I bet you none of these cars around here are appreciating that right now. That is like pink and purple. You can even see it in the camera. That's insane. Isn't that crazy? That looks so cool. You know, life moves pretty fast. And uh, if you don't take a second to look around once in a while, you might miss it. That's from uh, an old movie. I can't remember the name of it. It's a good movie. But something, someone's day is off. Someone's day off. I can't remember it. But as I was saying before, that's why I never get frustrated while I drive. Because it's always, I feel like there's always some sort of little plan in place. So yeah, just having a nice, casual, calm drive to the gym today, okay? Uh, I feel super tired today. Like, soups tired. Soups tired. And that's, a, that's okay. Hey, you guys want a little tip? I'll give you a little tip, okay? When you're when you're tired, you know, and it's it's time to train, and you feel tired, you wanna know what you do? You just do it tired. Feel tired, do it tired. You feel awake, do it awake. You feel sad, do it sad. Feel happy, do it happy. Either way, just do it. Nike. Here's another quote for you guys. I'll give you two, actually. There's the two quotes I kind of like to say in my head to like get me out of my bed or like to get me to keep going. They're, they're nice, nice casual quotes. Oh, they're good. They're not really casual. I don't know. They're good quotes. Quote number one. Stay true to what you said you would do long after the mood you set it in as the last. Meaning, I'm assuming you understand what it means, but let me get into this in detail for you. So many people like, it's like 12 o'clock at night, you know, you get that like big old burst of energy and you're like, oh, I could work out. I could go for a run right now. I could take on the world. I could do, I could start a business. See, whenever you get that feeling, you gotta you gotta take that moment to write it all down, write it all on a piece of paper. So it's your thoughts are written down, and now your goal has to be to stay true to what you said you would do, and stay true to it long after the mood you've set it in has left. That's how you become successful. Like the thing I, I don't uh, here, I don't hate it, but like the thing I hate the most is like when people DM me like, oh, how do you stay so motivated? And I just I don't know how to explain to people like I'm not motivated every single day. Like fucking barely half the time I'm even motivated. You think I'm laying in bed like, oh, I just can't wait to go to the gym at eight in the morning and train, and then train a second time later in the day like every single day it's it's not possible to stay motivated motivation doesn't last very long it's the discipline all right something that most people nowadays don't have and it's a tough thing to come by now but the trick is once you get motivated use that motivation to write down your plan don't don't use the motivation these this little burst of motivation you got to go do a workout or to go for a run or anything that's what i used to do when i got motivated out of nowhere when i was younger i would like go work out or i would go do this but then when i got older i was like let's use it to like write down the plan okay to exaggerate this plan so then i can stay true to this plan so once i'm at my best mindset let's write down all the stuff that i want to do and then once i'm at shitty moods or whatever i have to stick to it i wrote it down now you can very easily just not do it because 
because you're not motivated and that's your that's your choice everything you do in life is your choice but that's the thing if you can stay disciplined you can stick to it that's how you will achieve it especially nowadays there's not many disciplined people so it doesn't really take much to outwork most people nowadays because most people just complain and have that victim mindset of thinking the whole world's out to get them when really everyone's got the same 24 hours everyone's got the same day everyone's got the same month year everyone's living in the same world right now okay nobody's really got any sort of extra edge the only extra edge you can have on someone to someone else is your discipline and how hard you're willing to work and how many hours you're willing to put in into whatever the hell it is that you are doing and it's always all up to you this is all your choice it's always your choice anything you do in life is your choice all right oh and quote number two just this one's a simple one this one's a quick one just say it mind over matter and then just fucking get out of bed just think mind over matter so it's mind over your body okay your body wants to rest your body wants to lay down your body wants to relax your mind is able to wake it up mind over matter okay there's the other quote but we're at the gym the red zone the dead zone the kill zone the war zone okay let's get to work shall we all right handstand conditioning fun fun Okay, I'm not gonna say it because I never say it when I am this. I'm gonna explain to you what it is, but I'm not gonna say the words. You know when you have a cough and a runny nose, you feel tired, maybe you get headaches and stuff, and it comes around every year when the winter comes and stuff, you know, it's the opposite of warm. You're getting a okay. I'm assuming you understand by now, because I'm not gonna say it. That's what uh, that's what I am right now. I'm feeling a little under the weather. I guess I could say that. But uh, my trick when I feel under the weather uh, is uh, I just I always I always tell myself I don't get sick. I don't get sick. I'm always 100%. It seems like it goes away quicker if I say that. So I just constantly say that to myself. <clears throat> I'm just feeling like the a little bit of a sore throat. Uh, my nose is a little more plugged, but the tired aspect of it is the worst part. I just feel like absolutely drained. Like I've been awake for the last 48 hours. That's what I feel like. So we're uh, we're gonna just fight it out this week. Make this uh, make this cold, my bitch. But yeah, if you ever wonder why uh, I seem a little extra off today or tired or anything I feel like shit that's why there you go all right let's carry on we got our list our stuff to do we're gonna stay true to what we said we would do no matter what mood we're in we're gonna stay true to it long after the mood we've set it in has left let's get back to work one bar handstand now <sighs> Awesome. All right, other one bar. <sighs> ah, nice. Everything was still first try. That's good. Oh. Come with me. Let's go. Uh. Oh. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Felt completely fine yesterday. I woke up this morning and just fuck. Ah, just money. Feel great. Feel great. I feel good. I don't get sick. I don't get sick. <sighs> Japanese handstands. Let's get it. <sighs> nice. We got David Kushner going. He's gonna get us through the day here. Oh, I could literally fall asleep right now, like instantly, easily. Just like five minutes would be nice. Just five minutes. That's all I want. Mind over matter. Oh. Second set. Thankful for. Really quick, I just gotta, I just gotta count my links here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one,
five, six, seven, straight to heaven. There we go. Let's talk about what we're grateful for, okay? I'm grateful that I'm getting, I'm not, I'm not sick. I don't get sick, but if I were to have gone sick, this would, this would be a good time because and I'd be grateful for it because uh next week on Wednesday is when we leave for the competition in Texas so getting it now instead of while I'm there that's good um I'm grateful that I feel this way today and not yesterday when I had to do floor because feeling like this and doing floor is just uh I wouldn't pray for that upon my worst enemy we got high bar today that's not going to be too bad p bars it's going to be a little bit in the slumps there pommel shouldn't be too bad since I'm consistent with it now it might be a little bit of a, a challenge okay not an obstacle not uh something in the way just everything see everything as a challenge in life you know something that's challenging you to better yourself and just look at everything with a positive mind and you'll see nothing but constant improvement if you're wondering why i'm so motivational today i think i've said in a vlog before on the days where i'm like the most motivational talking to the camera that's when i'm the most motivational in my head because i gotta really like you know push through all the bullshit that i'm feeling on whatever day it is whatever's going on that day that's trying to like hold me back so that's why some days i'm really motivational because some days i'm just really not feeling it but today's not one of those days okay because i feel fucking amazing today a million bucks i feel great okay trick the mind fix the body see the results let's go yeah. I don't get sick. I don't get sick. Ah. Ah, nice. Everything was done first try, so that's good. Uh, that's one another thing to be grateful for. Um, number two, uh, it I just I felt a little bit weaker than normal, but still got through it. Mine so champion. All right. See, I'm the buck over there. That's right. We're still gonna go to vault. I got a list of things that I plan on doing during training. Every single training that I've been following relentlessly for years now. Sometimes the list changes a bit, but it's only allowed to change on days where I feel good. Days where I feel bad, I'm not allowed to use these uh, little excuses to uh, change morning training. Second training, second training, I can give myself a little bit of leeway. A little, not a lot, just a little. But uh, first training. First train is basic shit. I have no excuses. So let's go. Uh, let's go to vault. Okay, we're going to that vault. Thank God we did the real vault yesterday. It was not good. It was a waste of time doing it at all. But good thing we did the real one yesterday because now we can do this one today. Let's go to vault. See that? See that? The mic wasn't even on, so the cough doesn't count. So, anyways, time for vault. I'm. I could tape up my ankles. I'm not going to, cause I already. Even if I tape them up, I know how this vault session's gonna go. Cause uh, I'm not feeling the greatest. I'm still gonna give my maximum effort, but uh, maximum effort's usually here today. No, can't. I can't get to it. <laughs> so, same as usual. Two handsprings, five round offs. Yep. Let's get to work. Handspring number one. It's gonna be splendid. Country number two. All right, time for round offs. Round off number one. Mint. Round off number two. All right, watch your back. It's not too bad considering how I feel today, but it needs more pop, more heel drive. Everything, everything looks looks tired. So yeah, more power, more power. All right, round off number three. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna finish off on three instead of five. I think that's fair. It's okay. All three of them weren't like too bad. Still better than whatever yesterday's vault session was. So let's go to landings now. <sighs> All right, time for landings. One stick of everything, and then we can move right on with the next thing. Deadly. Alright. 
Let's go do some wonderful, wonderful shoulder physio. Yeah, I was gonna do the intro as you started going. Okay, what's up guys? <laughs> We're gonna do some uh, <coughs> shoulder physio. We're just gonna do very few sets up against the wall here, the same like we did the one time, the full circles, these ones, these ones, and there's one more. I remember there's one more. These ones, this one, this one. Oh, this one. Okay, we're just gonna do those four things for just one quick set. Then we're good. Oh. Alright, I'm gonna do the next shoulder. You, you guys will see me at the next station though. Alright, next station. Okay, next station. The this one. Oh, ah. my last station. Right, I did that one with the 10 pounds. Usually, I either do with the five pounds or no weight. Way harder with the 10 pounds. Sold my whole body up against the wall. All right, let's see in the shoulder physio. See you guys over at the P bars to do some beautiful swings. All right, welcome to everyone's favorite segment of the video: swing the handstands. 15 swing the handstands. Forgot to zoom in the camera for you guys. I would have been so far away. There you go. Enjoy. Nice, good stuff. Okay, one set down, one more to go. All right, second set. Five pirouettes, five swing nine cents. Let's go. Just need to. All right, guys, that's the end of first training. See you guys in second training. All right, welcome to second training. Uh, you people that are watching are the only ones that know how I'm uh, actually currently feeling. I don't want to tell anyone how I'm, like, you know, don't even say it, but yeah, because I gotta, gotta trick my mind. I gotta heal up quick here. So today is gonna be quite the, ch quite the challenge. Starting on P-bars here? So let's, let's get started. Probably gonna take a few warm-ups before I feel ready. The goal is to just do one routine and then be done. Well, and then probably do a few other things after. But I know that when I uh, don't feel my best, my energy level for training is kind of like, so I need to reserve some energy for high bar and palm on there. So let's go. All right, I'm probably gonna take like a good three more warm-up turns. I'm not gonna show them to you guys. We'll just uh, cut to me starting my routine. So yeah, cut to that. All right, we're just gonna go for the full routine. I don't have quite enough energy to like warm up, so I can't really warm everything up. I would blow through all my energy before I actually am warmed up and ready to do a routine. This is the way I feel. I don't think I'll ever feel like fully ready for it. So we're just gonna take this as a challenge. So uh, no reason to get upset with however this goes because I know how I feel. I'm just a challenge. So uh, if the first one of the first two or three skills are absolute shit. We'll just restart. But yeah, routine number one.
That was not bad considering. I missed the giant and it's just one. All right, let's try. We'll do half routine stuff now. All right, now for half routines or half routine. I don't know if it's plural. I don't know if we're gonna be doing more than one set. So half routine number one. Oh. So dizzy, so dizzy. Oh, I, Usually never dizzy, by the way. It's just because of what's going on. I'm gonna redo. We're done. I'm just gonna redo Hamna because everything else is all right. We have to just make one good Hamna. So we're not doing one more, but we're doing it until we get one good one. So however many it takes. Oh, we'll stop at five though if we end up getting there. Yeah, because they've been off recently, and usually they're like a very simple skill for me, which is weird. It's one of the few skills that are a big skill, but it's easy for me. So yeah, I just gotta. I gotta be quicker. So I'll just give it a few more tries. It changes what a speeding rock does to a bat. Ah. We all know. You did chat. We did it. <laughs> all right, let's go to let's go to high bar now. <coughs> all right, ladies, gentlemen. It's time for high bar. Uh, we're just gonna do skills, okay? I wanted to do routines. No, I don't think I'd survive. So. Skills. Unless I just end up catching everything and it just turns into a routine, then we do a routine. Hey Kyle, you're doing hard work in bio and it is boring. Physics is doing hard work and it's totally boring. F equals an F. All, all, the, all this guy knows is science and physics. Physics is so boring. Physics is so boring. This is going great. It was good other than the pain that hurt. <laughs> Great hands. All right, I fixed the camera angle because uh, I just watched. This is the first turn I just watched back, and I realized my legs cut out every clip. Kind of sucks. But the last turn was good. <laughs> Fucking that hurt. Right, the Stoops and Gaylords have been really good. We're just gonna do uh, one more colon. I just want it to be really clean. What if I don't hit there? No, sir. Nice. Okay, done high bar. Let's go to Palma. Okay, right, jump from all two to three Palma routines. Plain simple. Okay, let's go. All right. It's gonna be a challenge. Everyone knows why. Only you guys know why. No one else in the gym knows why, though. So just you guys know. All right, routine number one. I want, I want our song. Okay, I can hit the routine without the song, but like. It's like running, it's just easier with shoes, you know? Uh-huh. 
Soup's dizzy right now. Soup is dizzy? Soup's oh, dizzy. Soup. Like soup. Oh. Like super, but yeah, soup. No, like Alright. Routine number two. So it's a little bit higher. So you can see the Spitfire logo. Not high enough. There we go. Can someone just hold this while I do my palm routine? While you're doing your palm Yeah, routine. and make sure you stand fully in the way. Hey guys, this routine is sponsored by Spitfire Nutrition. Routine number three, I feel exhausted. Let's get it. <laughs> I am. Um, Let's go. Ah. 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 This song is going to be number one on my playlist by the end of 2024 for sure. Nothing, I was just thinking we're doing skills now. Have a song. Wrote down our song. Good stuff. Deadly. Oh. It's time. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. been a slice. Do a studio outro. All right, that's in training. Today was way better than I expected considering what I said is going on. Not saying it though, not gonna say it because I do not get sick. <coughs> okay, let's uh, high bar was really good, really good. P bar's progress, pommel three for three. So yeah, good stuff. You watch full video, enjoy, glad to hear that. If you watch the full video, comment the word. Tape, T A P E. I know how it's I know how it's spelled, I just like I was looking for a word, okay? Okay, bye, I love you.